three things we need to know over there. I only needed to know one. Oh, it was chilly. Yeah, this morning. yeah, no, it's another chilly start this morning. Mm -hmm. We're a little bit warmer in some spots, but it's going to overall be a really nice afternoon. The only problem is it's going to be a bit windy, unfortunately, but that will die down later today. But before it does, we're going to be seeing gusts over about 30 to 35 miles per hour at times with sustained winds at about 20 to 25 miles per hour possible here in Tucson. So definitely a breezy day. We're going to have some strong wind gusts at times, but at least we're not going to be as warm as yesterday. And even yesterday it was pretty nice, uh, but today we're going to be a few degrees cooler and then by tomorrow morning the coldest air settles in and that's why we have a freeze warning for some areas tomorrow morning a little bit more of a widespread light freeze so I'll talk more about that coming up but here is a look at the current wind speeds this is the sustained wind speed at 15 miles per hour in Tucson same thing in cells 12 miles per hour in Sierra Vista and 14 in Douglas so already a little bit breezy out there with some isolated wind gusts looking at your forecasted wind gusts uh, by 10 a.m. this morning most of us dealing with gusts over about 20 miles per hour, potentially over 40 in places like Oracle. So it'll definitely be very windy towards late morning and into the early afternoon, but that'll die down a little bit by 3 p.m. Still dealing with wind gusts over 20 miles per hour in Oracle and Safford, a little bit uh, uh, not as strong for areas to the south and east. And then by 11 p.m., still a little bit gusty in spots, but most of us dealing with a calmer wind compared to the rest of the day. So not going to be windy throughout the whole day. It'll eventually calm down later on this afternoon and into the evening hours. Metro Tucson's high today 78 degrees overnight tonight we're even dropping into the upper 40s here to mid 40s in some spots the east side potentially in the low 40s the mountains 46 degrees overnight lows in the 30s santa cruz county in the low 70s overnight lows in the 30s as well and then cochise county definitely going to be the coldest High temperatures today in the upper 60s. Overnight tonight, we could see some sub freezing temperatures, and that's why we have a freeze warning for a good portion of Cochise County. This includes places like Sierra Vista, Douglas, Benson, Tombstone, and Wilcox. And what this means is sub freezing temperatures are expected between 29 and 31 degrees and can kill sensitive vegetation and possibly damage unprotected outdoor plumbing. Remember to protect those four P's people, pets, plants, and pipes. And that uh, gets issued tomorrow morning and expires by 9 a.m. in the morning. And that also includes eastern parts of Pima County and places like Santa Cruz County, eastern Santa Cruz County, including Sonoida. So here's a look at the uh, pattern for today. Of course, windy, unfortunately, but that's helping keep our temperatures cooler. Chilly tomorrow morning, and then as we get into your Sunday, Saturday and Sunday afternoon, temperatures will rebound very quickly into the mid-80s. But don't worry, we'll have another shot of some cool air early next week. So here's a, a look at your seven-day forecast. Warmer over the weekend after that chilly start Saturday morning, and then temperatures drop back down to the 70s early next week. That is a check of weather. Let's